This is where he's at, and like seeing that plain picture, I was just like, and, and he was instant tears. Because I think watching their face and watching the screen, I had no clue what it meant, but I had a feeling that they weren't getting any, res like, they weren't getting anything once. And I remember seeing here in the end, and I went on the webpage and started looking at everything, and a uh, kid who was going to college and said that he was deaf with his cochlear implants. And I just remember thinking that I was like, oh my God, this kid's going to college. And uh, I can remember many times uh, looking at your site or looking at other ones and just, when, when you saw the hope part that you just you were like, oh my God, like, we could actually move forward with this. That's one of our, at least one of my breaking points. I'm like, I just got a call here in the end to see what's going on. And um, Kaylee called me back actually. And we talked for probably about an hour on the phone. Probably don't even remember that conversation at all, but I just remember the biggest thing is that there were things that we could do. And uh, that, um, that was, um, for me, it was huge. I mean, he was here in the support, but my whole world fell apart. It was just like, okay, I got. I have to get Olivia to school and I have to run to this appointment and this appointment and this appointment for Eric and he can't hear me and okay I got hearing aids and then okay how do I take care of the hearing aids okay okay I gotta get speech I gotta get okay oh, get physical therapy and I just fell apart a thousand times. Meeting people that have been there and, and done that and see that hope and that is those success stories and saying, okay, it, it's going to be okay. Like, we just basically sat down one evening and said, what is it that we want? What do we want to do? What's best for our family? What's best? What do we think is best for Mary? Hi! Hey, that's mommy! Is that mommy? He's not the last one. He's happy, you know what, Oliver? He's, He's happy he hears you. Was singing your favorite song? Trying to figure it all out. <laughs> it was wonderful. I mean, I, I was so excited I had to take a video and, and send it to our teacher. He was like, this is awesome. He's saying mommy. Because, I mean, I was taking groceries out of the car and he was still in the car seat and everything. And I'd come in, I was going back out to get something and I hear this, mommy. And I'm like, oh. so then I went to the back of the car and because he was still rear facing and I was like, mommy. And he's like, mommy, 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 mommy. I just kept getting him to say it as much as I possibly could because I was like, he's saying mommy. <laughs> um, and like, and saying it and knowing that he's saying it with me, it was, it was just amazing. Okay, are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see. Where's the doggy? The doggy. Lift it up. Is he under the bucket? Oh. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd go? Where'd the dog go? Where'd the dog go? No doggy. No doubt we better. Yeah, the, the progression is just, it's wonderful and it's very reassuring that, that we're on the right path and, and that we made the right decision for, for us and for Eric. What's the duck say? Quack, quack. What's that? It's a chicken. You know, I think we kind of look at here in the end as our, as our extended family and definitely our, 
our, in our, our family and are a huge support group for, for our family and for Eric, of course. Yeah. And, you know, looking back at it now, would I change it? <laughs> what I wish for, for both of my children, just a, a happy life. Yeah. Just enjoy life and to be able to take it all in.